hey loves welcome back to another video with me zay vlogs my name is xavier if you are new here welcome and if you are returning i thank you so much for your love and support so today's video is going to be a quick dollar tree haul to dollar tree but it's oh, been a while since i've done a shopping haul from there so i'm just going to show y'all the things they had at dollar tree this season okay so i'm gonna slide this bag right over and show you guys so this is new they had a tomato rocket it grows it can grow 100 of organic tomatoes it gives you the, the directions just plant and water and it has the actual image on here they had a lot a lot of gardening things which i was shocked and amazed if you want to do indoor gardening gardening or outdoor gardening they had everything you need so this is a painted daisy flowers it will grow the flowers they had the craft 3d craft wood 3d bugs it's 12 pieces in here for a dollar 25 i picked up the ladybugs and i also picked up another one now for easter crafts i did pick up this yarn craft you can make a bunny for ages three and up and i picked this up um, for the kids to work on i also got the um where you could paint the egg another craft this looks like a chickadee a bird it comes with three paint colors the paint stick so this is going to be something fun that they can do once they wake up if i'm whispering because i am they're still asleep and i don't want them to hear me right now and this is the bunny rabbit um ceramic painting set with the red paintbrush and three colors of your choice so this is the other indoor craft wood 3d bumblebees i believe this is like a peeling stick so you can peel it off and place it where it need be so that's the ladybug and the bumblebees they had so many duraflame mini fire starters at home or on the go i know i've seen people use these at, in their fireplace but it's good for indoor outdoor camping season is upon us so i know that those will be um come in handy for all the campers then they had this metal thermometer they had like four designs three or four designs i chose this one because it reminds me of spring summer and it is um how long is it it's 10.6 inches long 26.9 centimeters for your garden and here is the other yarn craft kit that i picked up for the girls that so you can make a little bunny face a cute cute um easter craft and then i got this for my son he can make um these little chickadees or bunnies it's the pom-pom kit he can make at least how many is it one two three four five six in a pack and it has the ears and everything you need pill and stick i believe i hope it doesn't require glue we will see so as far as the planting seeds they had these microgreens hot mix it takes about 10 days to harvest and it shows you gives you the directions on the back the planting um, instructions how long it takes to, to germinate and this is a five ground gram pack then I also picked up these tomato and lettuce by Paris Island COS, it is their planting seeds. Our seeds are always 100% non GMO. These were four for a dollar, so I did get those two. I picked up a corn, the carrots. I probably got more than eight actually. These are the cucumbers and green beans. The sizes um, this green bean is five grams, and the cucumbers are 600 milligrams of seeds inside. Then I picked up some morning glories. I thought they were pretty. And these are 425 milligrams for a dollar. 
And if you're new to gardening, all of the directions and the um, time frame for it to bloom and blossom, for your seeds to blossom and bloom, is on the back. And pretty much it tells you the average time and days, what you need to do. So that's those. And this is another pack of flowers, seed for seed flowers by American Seed. It's 14 grams in here of the Wildflower Blend Bird and Butterfly. It says easy to plant, just apply and water, an all natural mixture. And it gives you a little um, one, two on the back for those of us who are new or maybe not. And these are some microgreens that it takes about five days to harvest, it says. And these are five grams by American Seed as well. Now they had a big selection of these gardening gloves. Pink is my favorite color and these just remind me of spring and summer. So I went ahead and picked up a pair. So it's two to a pack for $1.25 at Dollar Tree. Some cute garden gloves for those who don't have any. American Seed also have these seed starter pots it is 10 pots okay so it's 10 seed starter pots for $1.25 and they are biodegradable the pots are two inches in depth depth I believe so American seed is coming through with all things gardening and then I picked up a big thing of potting soil this is an eight pound bag of potting soil if you can't make it to New Home Depot or whatnot, and it's special potting blend for indoor or outdoor use, blend it for proper drainage and support, and it is by Garden Collection. So yeah, they had a ton of these bags on hand as well. Okay, next is by Garden Collection, three stackable tier planner, and it looks like you can I'm new to gardening so yeah you can stack some plants flowers in here and you make and hang them as well and I also got this three pack of planters as well I wonder if it has a drainage at the bottom no it does not but it did come with these attached to it I'm not sure who this is by so I picked those up and then I did purchase the plant hanger. Let me see if I can make it where you can see it. Um, if you need something to hang your plants, these are cheap. $1.25, of course. Of course they're cheap. <laughs> it is 20.5 inches and 52 centimeters. Then Garden Collection also had these plants labels i believe you can write on it with a permanent marker or just get some stickers and add it to the planner to label your plants so you don't forget what is what and i saw these gladiolus trade horn three bulbs are in here these pretty red flowers i was just picking up things that i um, caught my eye and attention but these are 125 at Dollar Tree and I'll see go from there with that I picked up two of the Dudley's coloring cups because we possibly may color eggs is five coloring cups and five coloring tablets with one egg dipper this is the other so that is pretty much all for the gardening items I'm gonna move this out the way so I can continue with the next set of things. So they had these cute little Easter baskets. So I'm really going to just show you guys everything and then do a voiceover from here. So as you all can see, I picked up two of the purple Easter small baskets. Um, they're like tin can style. And I also picked up a yellow one with the carrots on it for my son. And they're pretty durable. And what I'm going to do is just add these Russell Stover bunny, milk chocolate bunnies to them and to put something together small for the kids um, for this Easter. I didn't go all out and do um, a big Easter basket because we just came from Disney and 
pretty much this is what it is for Easter this year. So as you see, I got three of the Russell Stover bunnies. I got some peanut butter cups by Palmer, all from Dollar Tree, a dollar twenty-five cent each. A dollar twenty-five cent each, as well as the peanut butter eggs, um, the chocolate filled eggs with peanut butter by Palmer's. I purchased some eggs like a couple about a month ago a couple of weeks ago so i'm just gonna put everything in the individual eggs drop the eggs in the basket i'm also gonna um fit some dum-dums in there now the dum-dums won't fit in the easter eggs i'm gonna just have those in each um small easter basket the tin can baskets i couldn't find any easter grass of course because it was literally two days before easter when i went and got these things which was yesterday i did pick up some palmer's cookies and cream egg shaped eggs as well that's going to go in their eggs and I'm going to just make it cute and simple for the kids and I also found some bunny money uh, the cute little <laughs> chocolate um, circles they probably have like I'm not sure some type of crunch in it and starburst you can't go wrong with those and the fun size I'm going to add those into the eggs as well and then I found the peeps. Now I don't, um, I'm not, I'm not a fan of peeps, but I did pick up some peeps that'll be cute with the buckets. I got one of each color, yellow, purple, and pink for the youngest. My son will get the yellow, and Raleigh will get. And the that will pretty much daughter. do it today for. So they each have their own color. And yeah, that is pretty much video. it. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more. And as always, continue saving, continue stocking up. Be blessed and happy Resurrection Sunday. And here is my finished product of the Pom Pom Kit Craft. It was six of them, so I decided to go ahead and create one. And it was fairly easy. I was thinking glue would need to be included, but honestly, if you just stick the pieces on it just stays on so that's something i didn't know but yeah it was pretty easy super cute and a quick fun craft so here we have the little cute bunny that my oldest raleigh made she's made two so far they're super cute and so easy to put together like i was saying no glue is required this is Raya. She has made her first bunny. You just stick the felt together, place the eyes in there, scoop the um, two yarn pom-pom balls together, and there you have it. And we're moving along over here to my son. He's getting his eyes on for his chickadee, the same thing that I made. And he pretty much has that together. Super cute easy peasy lemon squeezy yeah so that's a quick um craft that i have them doing on easy, this saturday easy morning peasy chicken 